it's opening night at Pleasant Valley High School. The Spartans are set to hit the home hardwood for the first time this season, with the sophomores setting the stage as usual. Number 34, Parker Crest. But for Parker Crest, this night was unthinkable just eight short months ago. I thought I'd be like starting to walk eight months later or something like that, not playing basketball. Parker has been through a lot in the past couple years. A battle with cancer led to an infection in his right leg and the decision to have that leg amputated in March. The day of surgery, of course, we were nervous. I think that just comes with the territory, but after it, he was nothing but smiles and ready to just start working out again. Uh, it's just who I am, I guess. I'm just always trying to smile through things and just find the good things and not the bad. Why dwell on something we can work to get better on something? With the help of physical therapist Matt Rokes, Parker hit the ground running. Once I got his prosthetic, it was straight on there. We were working hard, just trying to get me back to running. We were I wasn't we weren't planning on going for basketball, but he just worked me so hard that I was just ready for it. That's right, basketball. Parker turned his thoughts to the sport he loves. I uh, didn't know if I was healthy enough, like running wise and stuff to be here. Day before tryouts, maybe even day of tryouts, I don't really remember. I went and talked to Coach Algren. It was honestly one of those things that he just looked at me with this confidence that I didn't even hesitate. Like as soon as he's like, Coach, I want to play. I, I want to be on the team. I was like, okay, yeah, let's go. I was shocked. I, uh, I didn't think I was going to be able to make it. After clearing a few hurdles with the Iowa High School Athletic Association, Parker joined his fellow Spartans and wasted no time fitting in. I think every single day, and I'm getting goosebumps right now thinking about, this kid is going for it. He's not, he's not sitting to the side, he's not playing any cards, he's just going 100% all the time. That hard work and determination paid off. With the Spartans up 14 late in the fourth quarter, all eyes turned to the end of the PV bench. He's kind of looking up at me like, is this, is this it? Is this happening? And I said his name once and he kind of looked at me and pointed at his chest like me. I'm like, yeah, Parker, go, man. I was surprised. Uh, Algren called my name and I was like, me? I stood up and everyone started going crazy and I didn't know how to react. Parker hit the floor running for the final 40 seconds and firing. As the buzzer sounded, Parker was mobbed by friends and now more importantly, teammates. It was just amazing. I mean, I actually played and stuff, and like I've never like experienced that before as a team. I told him that's the loudest a sophomore gym has ever been, and that's just credit to you and what you are as a kid and what you have done for the community. A special start to a story that's just getting started.